Hello, welcome to another class of profit and loss series of India IDU tutorials. This is our another class on examples. So our first example is the cost price of 20 articles is same as selling price of X articles. If the profit is 25%, then the value of X is. As I have discussed earlier, in this type of questions in YouTube, assume something. So let's assume that cost price of a single article is equal to rupee 1. So CP of one article is equal to 1 rupee. So CP of 20 articles would be equal to 20 rupees and similarly CP of X articles would be equal to X rupees. Now it is given that profit is 25% then the value of X. This is the profit percentage and profit in this case would be profit is equal to sorry this is SP. I'm sorry this is the CP and SP of this X articles is equal to 20. So profit here would be SP minus CP which is equal to 20 minus X. Now we have the formula that profit percentage is equal to profit upon CP into 100. Profit percentage is given as 25. Profit is equal to 20 minus X and our CP is equal to X into 100 and we need to find out the value of X. So this is equal to 25 X is equal to 20 minus X into 100 which is equal to 4. X is equal to 4 into 20 is 80 minus 4X. This will be shifted here. That is 4X plus X is equal to 80. So 5X is equal to 80. That is 16. So value of X is 16. So he has sold 16 articles at a price of 20. Now let's have one more example. Another example is in a certain store the profit is 320% of the cost. If the cost increases by 25% but the selling price remains constant approximately, what percent of selling price is the profit? Now let's assume that cost price of the product is rupees 100. So our SP would be equal to 100 plus 320 percent of 100 which is equal to 100 plus 320 upon 100 into 100. 100 plus 320 is 420. So this is our old SP and this is our old CP. Now in the new case if the cost increases by 25 percent. So our new CP is equal to 25% it increases that is 100 plus 25% of 100 that is 125 is our new CP and our new SP is same which is 420 now. We need to find out that if the price remains the constant what percentage of selling price is the profit. So it is mentioned that what percentage of selling price. So first calculate the profit which is equal to 420 minus 125 which is equal to 295. Now profit percentage is equal to profit upon SP into 100. Generally, we calculate profit percentage as profit upon CP into 100. But as it is mentioned in the question that what percentage of SP? So we will take SP. Now, profit is equal to 295 and our SP is 420 into 100. Now, after solving this, this will come 
70% as approximate. So 70, they make around 70% of the selling price as their profit. Let's solve one more example. Another example is what is the maximum percentage discount that a merchant can offer on her marked price so that she ends up selling at no profit or loss if she had initially marked her goods up by 50%. So let's assume that the cost price of the product was rupees 100. Now marked price would be equal to 100 plus 50% of the cost price which is equal to 100 plus 50 upon 100 into 100 which gives us 150 as a mark price. Now the question asks that how much discount she needs to give so that she makes no profit and no loss. In this case if she has to make no profit and no loss she has to sell the good at CP that is at rupees 100 only so SP becomes equals 100 and our profit becomes SP minus CP that is 0. So in this case she will earn no profit, no loss. But the difference between the mark price and this selling price is 50 rupees. So our discount percentage should be equal to this 50 that is X percent of 150 is equal to 50. That is this percent discount on 150 will yield 50 rupees discount so that she can sell the goods at 100 rupees. Now x upon 100 into 150 is equal to 50. x is equal to 50 into 10 divided by 15 was 2 that is 5 into 2 5 into 3 100 upon 3 which gives 33.33 percent thus she needs to give the discount on 33.33 percent practice these more questions from our tutorials and for more tutorials you can stay tuned with indiaedu.com